Hello and welcome! Happy Friday! This is episode 18 of The Ballad of Wyatt Holiday. My name is Joshua, and I know sometimes playing these single-player RPG games can be a bit lonely or isolating, so if you ever feel those feelings creeping up, feel free to put on this video or any video I do in this series, and you can consider yourself to be gaming with a friend. What are we playing today? I am going to be playing Starfield. I know, shocker. But I got... Uh, we're going to keep it a little light on this Friday. We are going to explore the Star Eagle for a bit. Wow, that was a powerful burp. I hope you didn't have to hear that. But we're going to explore the Star Eagle and just do some bounty missions in that. I kind of want to test the ship and kind of put it through its paces. And maybe we'll do another... Sorry, I just drank a whole bunch of this damn sparkling water. And it's got me just, you know, burpy and gurpy. But yes, we're going to test this... Oh, look at that. Yeah, we're going to test this bad boy out. Uh, I'm going to go pick up a, a Tracker's Alliance mission. Also, maybe the power boost pack is not great on a high-gravity world. I'm, I'm thinking. Yeah. But we're going to pick up a mission board. Some Tracker's Alliance stuff. Destroy Clim Crimson Fleet at Arane. Yep. We're going to do that as well. And we're going to go pick up a, a Ranger mission. Woo! Here we are at the rock. Um... I believe it's the Fortress Monastery of the Dark Angels, Space Marine Chapter. Is that joke ever going to get old to me? I don't think so. So, we'll pick up another uh, Freestar Rangers mission. Um, what else do we have? Rescue the Hostage. Having serious problems with spacers hijacking spaceships and holding crew hostage. Mm, is that something I might need targeting control systems for, or does it just disable the engines automatically? I don't know. We're going to try it. We'll be in the Irandi system. Ooh. Or the Eridani system. Fun fact about the Eridani system. I may be wrong, but I don't think I am here. The Eridani system is actually the same star system where the planet Reach was located in the Halo series. Uh, most notable for the game Halo Reach. Uh, not the series, but the planet itself. Um, and also the novel, Fall of Reach, I think it was called. And uh, it was the second planet in the Eridani system. And I believe if you go to the Eridani system here in Starfield, I believe as a result of their merger with Xbox, you go to the second planet in the Eridani system, and it does look rather Reach-like. It's a very uh, lush-looking planet in a, in a vein very similar to the planet Reach. God, I love Halo. Never played 4, 5, or Infinite, which I suppose is 6. Oh man, that's kind of a fun skip pack, or boost pack if you're trying to... Okay. Oh, parkour. Let's all just take a moment here. We all want to protect people from the Ooh. Ashtown. We're on the same side here. Mm-mm, the hell with that. This ain't the way things are done, and that's the end of it. With due respect... I have repeatedly explained that I do not need permission. I, I came to you in the spirit of cooperation, but if this is the reaction... Sam, get the fuck out of the way, dude. You've done this my way, and it has always worked. Always! Why are you trying to fix something that ain't broke? Mr. Wilson, we can deal with the Ashta better, safer. We didn't turn down fire or uh, space flight because we'd managed just fine until that point. I will not be talked down to like this. Okay. Miss Alpin, please don't take any further action until we've had some time to think this over. All right? Oh, well, if they're looking for ways to fight the Ashta, that might be worth looking into for our ranger here. I mean, why wouldn't he want to help out with something like that? Alright, but first... Ah, we gotta look left. Uh, we're gonna get in this ship now. We've got plenty of 
side mission, so this might be a bit of a longer one. Depends on how quick we can do these missions. And depends on how long it takes us to uh, kind of look at this ship here. Alright, so yeah, we have Sarah and Barrett here now, which is nice. Ooh, looks a little cramped, I'm not gonna lie. What is it? Something you need? See what she has. I thought you'd never ask. Here. Thank you. Until later. Who else is in here? Oh, there's Barrett. Do you need anything I can help you with, Captain? He's probably got some food for us. Oh, right, right. Almost forgot about it. <laughs> this is for you. Oh shit, I'll take a grilled cheese any day. Okay, so this is, uh, looks like a little systems bay here. Very nice. I mean, we can boost pack, but why don't we just use the elevator like civilized people? That's nice. A weapon rack? <gasps> and we got a fucking little jail cell! We got a little jail cell! Amazing. I highly doubt we can use it for anything. This is probably the only time anyone's gonna sleep on that, but... jail cell we can hold four criminals <gasps> and we have a secretary's desk filled with poutine and pancakes I feel like I'm at a hockey game oh, Cora's got her own little area here nice very nice I dig it Let's see the cockpit. I'm, I'm assuming this is the cockpit. That's where the thing's taking me. <gasps> oh my god. This is beautiful. This is amazing. Absolutely stunning. Oh look, we can see inferior ships landing. Huh. This is just, it's, it's just swell. Where else can we go? Close, goddammit. Alright, I saw another uh, ladder here. Let's get on up there. Oh, do we have another ladder? Or is that the docking uh, port? Yeah, that's a docking bay. Oh, it's... Why am I got, like... Barely any sound for that. Oh, interesting. Cool. Oh, this must be like a captain's quarters. Huh. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. It's not quite the Normandy, but I don't mind it. I do not mind it one bit. I just don't know why that door is so muffled. A problem for another time. We have some things to take care of now. First off, we gotta watch this. We gotta watch this bitch take off, okay? Oh, yeah. <sighs> oh, buddy. I think we're going to need, uh, Oh my god, 
it kind of looks like a, a rebel Y-wing bomber, like just a little bit. Orbital insertion complete. May now move freely about the cabin. Oh my gosh! Well, let's get them shields up to one hundo, baby. How fast does this go at top speed? I think the Frontier can only go about 194. So this is... Despite being able to allocate more power to the engine, it's roughly contemporaneous uh, in speed. I don't know if I'm using contemporaneous correctly, honestly. But that's that's okay. Um, Electro... Is it... I don't think it's any of these crewmates that have electromagnetic weapons for a ship ability. That might be Andresia. Particle beam. Yeah, that might be Andresia. Oh, no! It's Vasco. But just one, one star. <gasps> oh my god, look at it. Let's see it in third person while we're flying. <gasps> oh, man. Hit that boost. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. How fast do we go with reverse thrusters? Oh, okay. I gave each one two more. Um, I think before we do any of these missions, uh, crap, crap, sorry, we should head to Alpha Centauri. Maybe we can finally meet up with Andresia. Still, um, I think we can finally add her to the crew. I think we just got to meet up with her once. Hopefully, she's back at the lodge. It's been a while since we've been there. Obviously, Wyatt and Sam have been away for quite some time. Thank you. Who do we have? Vasco, Sam, Sarah, Barrett. We here for the lodge? Yes, we are. We may be able to uh, fit Andresia in our crew. Oh, I'm gonna take some damage. Nope guess not. I think one thing we need to focus on moving forward leveling up wise is our um, is our um, fitness skill getting our oxygen up for sure. Let's head to mast. Doing this uh, free star ranger quest line has made me uh a uh, little nostalgic in the sense that it's good to be on my first character I didn't do it but I did the Vanguard storyline the UC stuff and it was, it was so good I loved it whereas uh, Rangers plays like obviously Cowboys in Space um, which is great I actually really really love it um, the Vanguard played like a crazy action movie with just the right kind of twists and turns, I think. Some that weren't particularly, like, cheesy or annoying. I think there's a great mission where you gotta go to Tullaman 2. Oh, it's so good. And it... I was genuinely kind of on the edge of my seat. You got time for a quick chat? I appreciate it when you're able. Bro, what? Sam, stop, man. You need to be stopped. I've occasionally had my doubts about Kong. Oh, 
Hopefully she's around here somewhere. It's been a long time since we've been to the lodge. Do I have to do... Do we have to do another... Um, maybe we have to find the artifact on Tau Seti before we can bring Andre... Get Andresia back. I probably should have known that. But anyway, that's fine. That's fine. It was nice to check in at the at the lodge anyway. Not sure how much checking in we did, but Whoa. Caught on to it, baby. There we go. I think on a low gravity world, the power pack would be a lot of fun. A lot, a lot of fun. I know myself, and I think I would enjoy that. Oh shit, somebody just called me. Very nice. <gasps> oh, doesn't it just look so swell? So eventually we're going to have to go find that artifact on Tau Seti 2 uh, and help out, or and, and recruit Andresia. Oh. jump there. Yep, we can. We're gonna go take out... Who are we going to fight? Crimson Fleet Captain. This is uh, one of our Ranger Board missions, so... Oh, look at that thing! I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, this... Fleet captain has no idea what he's in for. Or she. No, let's, uh. There we go. Oh, man. I can feel the freedom while I'm flying in this Star Eagle. Alright, there you are, bitch. Oh, okay. G is my laser. That is really strange. What do EM weapons do? <gasps> oh, can we dock with them? Now let's just blow them up. Now we've leveled up. We've got some things we can do here. 
fitness would probably be a good one, having 10% more oxygen. But is investing and piloting worth it? And, and some of these other things, like targeting control systems, shield systems. Hmm. Or maybe even upgrading medicine. I just, you know, I don't know. And we're not exactly hurting for money right now, so I don't know if we need this. But also just maxing out our health would be a good idea, too. Hmm. This would help if we want to upgrade the reactor class of this Star Eagle. I don't know how really modifiable it is. Well, I mean, all ships are modifiable, but... Hmm. You can now utilize ship's thrusters? Can we not do that already? Hmm. I don't know. I'll, I'll, we'll have to think about it. For now, I think this is a good one. Having 10% more oxygen to be able to do things. I think that'll just help us when it comes to sprinting. So now we're going to go destroy another Crimson Fleet uh, ship. This one is not a Ranger mission. This is a Tracker's Alliance mission, so this is for the Bounty Hunters. It's nice having Sarah on board the ship again, just so we can grav jump uh, a little quicker. God, I shouldn't be drinking soda right now. This is just awful. But I ran out of sparkling water. All right. Yes. Didn't realize we were going to be fighting that quickly. Get fucked. Boom. Enemy's jump drive is offline. Boom. Just fuck these cats up, though. I don't know if any of these were our mission targets. Probably not. But it's still good to get rid of them nonetheless. Ooh, definitely hit that. Why don't we uh, see if we can say hi? They usually want to give you something. I love putting crimson fleet dogs down. Me too, you Sturgis. The Star Rangers, right? Space is always just a little safer with you folk around. Any way we can repay you? <laughs> yeah, give me some of that money. Of course. Can't stay here, Gavin, all day. Fly safe. Now they want to hail me. Thanks Except. Again for the help. Over now. Oh well, you're welcome. That is just real swell. Alright, where are the ones we're looking for? Ooh, there's a ship here. Why don't we fly to it? Trading ship. Oh, come on, slow it down, slow it down. All right. Hello? Hello? Did I turn it on? I'm thank God. The instructor, she won't wake up no matter what I do. And the ship, I just don't know what's going on. Oh no, it's about to start moving again. Help! What happened to the instructor? Oh yeah, power off everything. What? Stop this 
ship. Just stop it and help the instructor, please. It's moving again. What the hell do you want me to do, bro? I can't make it stop. Make it stop. Shoot, there should be. Don't worry, man. We're docking. I'm a ranger. Helping people is what Ship I do. Ship is now docked. Perfect. Didn't even smudge the paint. Talk to me. Come on, Sam. Let's go arrest this guy for being a moron. I think I gotta go. How you do it, boy? You're here when you got a moment. Oh, I. Nice. Good to see you. Thanks, buddy. You too. Oh, come on. Where do I go? You man, you stopped the ship. I was going to die. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Oh, well, we've got some uh, med medicine dialogue here. We could say you have a medical bracelet. It says seizures, and there's your pen. Here goes. <laughs> okay. What? Oh, thank you. Is my student all right? The ship? Everything is fine. You gave us quite the scare. Oh, man. Sorry. So sorry. I'm gonna catch my breath, and then I'll get us back to port. Take this. You deserve it. Oh, I, I do. I didn't know what I was going to do. Mm, a lot of crying. Ugh, I feel weak as a kitten. But still alive and kicking. Hey, no worries, I get it. Just let me uh, steal a few of your things and I'll be off. Thank you. If you hadn't come around... Yeah, you'd be dead and this idiot would be crying until he died of starvation. Sheesh. Let's talk to Sam real quick. The Freestyle Rangers. You did that dirty work and then some. So how'd you feel wearing the badge? Well, I mean, I'm st still wearing it, but, uh... You know, all the kids I grew up with fantasized about this moment. It doesn't seem real. The reality of the job is... dirtier than cops and robbers on the playground. Me, I never cared much for being a ranger. Too many of them try to force the world to be only black and white when it's anything but. Take Ron Hope. I mean, the guy's a legend. Before him, Polvo was a desperate, depressing place. Everything he did was to keep his people employed. To keep Hope Tech standing in a backstabbing world of megacorp politics. I mean... The whole situation with him is complicated. Sadly, it is. Tough call on what to do with Ron Hope. Taking his hush money wouldn't have sat right with me. But I wonder what's gonna happen to Hope Town without him. Well... You know, people died. Mr. Hope has to face justice for what he did. I think Paxton Hall went out of control. But no doubt Ron Hope bears some responsibility. As much fun as it is being a ranger, I hope you can start focusing on constellation business. There's plenty of mysteries left in the good old Milky Way to discover. Alright, don't try to railroad me, buddy. I appreciate having a, an in-depth discussion about something like that. Because I feel like those are the kind of things games neglect. Get the hell out of my fucking quarters. No, stay out of there. That isn't for you. Okay, I guess it is for you now. It's just... My quarters are for everybody.
Yeah. Oh. I could not get in. <laughs> Sorry. I was lost in the memory for a moment there. How can I help? By doing your job. Wouldn't it be funny if we just blasted these two out of the sky? Probably gonna grab jump now that we're on dock. Yeah. Alright. Well, that was actually a good deed. Hope you can focus on constellation business. I'm gonna get back to constellation business, Sam. Why don't you let me kind of enjoy the fruits of my labor real quick? We did this investigation together. Fire at everything. Like, that's a bit much. the one we were here to destroy, so why don't we just take out the rest of these while we can. God, I'm not used to lasers being my G button. Yeah, let's, but first let me uh, charge my shields a little bit. Alright, cool, we're charging up a smidge. Dad, have you ever tried Aurora? we got here. Search the rest of these wrecks. I'm kind of kicking myself a little bit for not having uh, done some of these missions sooner. That was fun. That was fun. Now we're gonna have to try out this hostage rescue mission for the Rangers. Rescue hostage at Arandi 6. Or Eridani. At least with Sarah on the ship, we can grab jump in 5 seconds with 1 power instead of 8. It'll save me time during editing when I have to review the footage. I will not get tired of that. All right, there it is. I think this is a someone in there we got to rescue. Can't skip the target city there. there. No grab drive. drive now. Enemies to grab drive out of right. position. <laughs> Target's jump nice. system down. Hostile boarding actions. And here a couple of uh, Imperial Navy breachers are about to board the Gallo Dark. 
Sorry, I had to get a Warhammer reference in. You know I did. Let me close this. Oh, I guess it can never... It just can never close. Alright. Ooh! Uh, I think this is a bad idea to climb up here like this, but whatever. Ah! Oh! Reload. Boom. Alright, I'm not gonna lie, this is a lot of fun. Oh, man. Holy guacamole. Sammy, buddy. I need you to start pulling your weight here. I know, it's asking a lot for a companion from a Bethesda game, but before, before I was playing, before I was making content here for YouTube, um, and, and getting back into Starfield, I had taken quite a break from it after a, a while, because I played it for a hot minute, almost non-stop, well, non-stop in the sense that whenever it was my free time and uh, and uh, before that I was playing Fallout 4 quite a bit and and and, and I had Paladin Dance as my main companion because I was I was playing a Brotherhood uh, character uh, I, I just I love the Brotherhood of Steel so much so I was so used to just pallet and dance being around and you know when you have a big power armored guy like that it really holy die. shit us off. come on come on come on all right I hope you're here to help I don't think it's safe yet oh you got a lot of stuff I thought I was dead just plain dead you rangers are something else. You stay safe out there. <laughs> I'll do my best. <laughs> After you undock, I gotta get straight back to it, but thank you. Well. Thanks again. She just stays tied up. I mean, hey. I am one to King Shame. Am I still? I'm still carrying a ton of gear. That was fantastic. I enjoyed every second of that. I very much enjoyed every second of that. Um, we're definitely going to have to uh, rest up. Uh, snoring. What can I help you with? You can stop pointing that fucking gun at me. Excuse me. Not bad. This was not bad at all. This is a fun little ship. This could suit our purposes for the entirety of the game. Um, with maybe just a little modification here and there. Um, maybe just shield stuff like that. Maybe upgrade the, the reactor class if we can. 
some of those C-class reactors get quite large. I've done a lot of ship customization in this game. None of it was aesthetically pleasing, but I did build a couple of powerhouses. But they were, man, no matter what I did, them things were slow and unmaneuverable. They were not aerodynamic. But that's what we're going to call this one for now. I had a really good time with this one. This one was really, really great. Um, I hope next... I, I don't know what we're going to do Monday. I have no clue yet. Probably it's going to start, though, with us selling a ton of gear. We have a lot of gear here to get rid of. Maybe we'll give Sam that, that special lawgiver weapon we got for completing this quest line. I think that... We might also keep that for ourselves. I mean, we've gone for like a pistol build, but eh, no, no, we'll keep the dead eye. I like the dead eye. I'm I don't plan on switching from that weapon unless like a, another Razorback comes along and it's just like insanely powerful, which with level scaling in this game, I imagine would be quite soon. But I just don't want to get rid of it because it looks so nice. It looks so cool. But if I could get something with a reflex sight, I wouldn't I wouldn't be too upset. So we're going to call it here. This was a fun one. Lots of action today. I mean, three ship, four ship battles, I think, if you count that training ship. So this was, this was fun. And, uh, you know, if you enjoyed this, you know, hey, leave me a like. Uh, maybe even subscribe if you're uh, enjoying keeping up with this little story we have developing here. And uh, if you didn't like it, leave me a dislike. You're not going to offend me, but if you do leave me a dislike, drop down in the comments and let me know what it is that you didn't like. Was it my presentation? Do you not like the game? Or is there something else I failed to take into account? But more than any of that, I am just so thrilled that you took time out of your Friday to game with me. And I will see you next time in the Starfield.